Hello and welcome to my channel. I wanted to show you a stitch. Many of you, you know this stitch. It's a very easy stitch, one row repeat, the stitch is reversible. I think for a scarf, for a hat, for a vest, this is quite nice and it's quite thick. This yarn recommends that I, sh I should use 5.0 at the most, but I used 7.0 millimeter crochet hook. This stitch, if you want for a scarf, for example, or even a hat, I would suggest you use at least one num, maybe one one and a half or two numbers bigger than uh, the crochet hook than the yarn recommends. If you want, for example, for um, if you have pets and you want just a blanket on the pet uh, bed or where on the couch, uh, use the exact crochet hook number that the yarn recommends. It's gonna be quite uh, how you say sturdy, rigid, and it's gonna stay flat, uh, really nice, and the corners will not get uh, twisted. Yeah, but for a scarf, and it's quite elastic. The stitch is reversible, front and back is the same, but with this stitch I would recommend a soft yarn, elastic soft yarn. Yeah. This is quite easy and goes really fast, this, uh, this stitch. Well, many of you, you know this stitch, it's called the thermal stitch. For a scarf I will uh, suggest you use two numbers bigger than the, the crochet hook, than the yarn recommends, that's the best. The, the stitch is very, very easy, you just do single crochet, but you're gonna pick up the back loop and the line underneath there, and you're gonna do a single crochet. With this, you, with this stitch, the thermal stitch, you can uh, chain any numbers of chains. This one doesn't have multiples of two or three or... Uh, you can chain any numbers you want. And it's quite easy, this one. So you, the stitch is here, you pick up the back loop and the line there, and you pass the yarn to the two lines and then pass the yarn to the two loops, and so on. And you do like this until you finish your project. And you can do this stitch even with the double crochet. It's the same thing. You go through the back loop and the loop below. And you do like a double crochet. If you try with a half double crochet, it's not going to work. You're going to have the back loop, the stitch here, but you're not going to have this line. This one, the second one. But with uh, double crochet, it works quite, uh, quite nice, and it's thick. Yeah, and you chain one, and you turn your work, and you keep doing this. If you like to work this with, for a um, work with this stitch for a scarf, or a vest, or a hat. If you work with the same crochet hook, the the yarn recommends is gonna be quite sturdy and rigid yeah you can do with this stitch for example a placemat you can do a rug you can do so many things because it's very thick if you work with the exact crochet hook uh, that your yarn uh, recommends so for a teapot holder or whatever something like that I think it's nice leg warmers it's quite nice so, just an idea, if you want to try some of you, one row repeat stitch goes really fast for a scarf, for a hat, for a vest, and it's quite dense. You're not going to have holes in between the stitches, yeah, for a warm, let's say, scarf in winter, yeah. Well, thank you for watching. Try this, uh, this stitch with a bigger crochet hook and you will see that you will enjoy this, uh, this stitch. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.